Good morning everyone. Uh, trying to be a little bit quiet as Courtney's still sleeping. Uh, last night the clocks did go forward an hour, so I'm up extra early I guess, even though it's 7.30 now. I've been up for about an hour. Uh, yeah, today is week four, and this week it's a deloading week, four kilometres now I have been a little bit sick this week with a little cold, it seemed to have been and gone over a couple of days. I uh, did manage to do a fast 5km park run yesterday, I was aiming for under 24 minutes. It didn't happen, mostly because there was an incident at park run, and I hope the uh, person's alright. They just had a bit of a fall, more of a shock to the ego, but they're still a good person, so I stopped to help them. Um, yeah, so today hopefully there's no one falling around. <coughs> See, still got a bit of a cough. Hopefully there's no one falling around. Um, yeah, uh, today's training program has got me doing a 14 kilometer run, but they did say in the program that if I do feel like doing a race, even though I've done one yesterday already, uh, then I can aim for a fast 10 kilometer. It did say to do 5 minutes 10 per kilometre, but me being me, I want to push the envelope a little bit further than that, <laughs> I think. I want to aim for under 50 minutes. Mister! So that will be a 4.59 minimum pace on average. Yeah, so I'm going to see how it goes. Wow, very windy, strong headwind at the start and at the end it will be so hopefully i get to pick up the pace after i turn a few corners it's very warm out here my throat is already really dry i have to try and get some water when i can oh, i'm not giving up but i don't think sub 50 is in the in the works today 88 that is correct. Okay. That's a big no. Uh, my left hamstring feels very bad. Um, I'm going to walk to get some water and I may even cancel this whole run. I feel like if I keep pushing this heat, I'm probably dehydrated. I haven't had nearly enough water and doing the fast run yesterday. Should not be doing a fast one again today. So, play it smart, cancel the goals. I still want to get some water. I can feel myself limping now and I'm walking. So, play it safe and we can go again another day. Yep, sounds good. All right, get down here, have some water and go back. Got to think of it long term. I was mentally there, because it was like, I could be like this on race day, but I feel like if I run now, or do anything with a lot of speed, I'm probably going to pull a hamstring. And I was saying in my videos last night that I was editing, to not do get my shit together. I've had a sore tendon in my foot and a cold and now this. I'm sure it's just dehydration and need to do some stretching before I'm rolling. But I'll get it sorted. Go again tomorrow for a gym workout. See you soon after I've got some water. Bye. Always refreshing. All right, I'm going back home. Calf muscle, I mean not calf muscle, hamstring does not feel good at all. So yeah, let's um... Sorry for it being a bit windy in the video, but this is gonna be the last part of today's video. Hamstring feels like it's failing. 
like that's the best way I can describe it. It's almost like I'll go to walk and be like almost like there's no support at that point where that bit just collapses. That's what it feels like to me. I don't know any other way to describe it. Uh, I think I'm just going to go straight home. Well, I already am. And get straight into a, I think an ice bath will be best just to try and get rid of any kind of inflammation. And then that warming up process will be the leg healing, getting some blood flow back to it. So yeah, what a shit way to start the month. <laughs> anyway, stay positive, just treat everything the best you can. Um, yeah, anyway, hope you guys have an awesome day. Good evening everyone. I have some good news. So, yesterday I was recording the video uh, during my 10 kilometer run and yeah, it didn't go well as you seen before this segment. Uh, it is now Monday the day after. I ended up calling in to try and get a basically emergency appointment with Guy. I managed to get one for half an hour and Good news is the calf, oh not the calf muscle, the hamstring, it is a little bit uh, sore and tender. It's not strained or torn or whatever. So I've definitely done the best thing I could to have like that ice bath for like 30, 40 minutes yesterday. Um, just continuous ice packs and doing some light massaging and all that is like the best thing I could have done even ice packing on the way to work I just sat on the ice pack um, he says I've done a good job there's no point in icing it anymore I've had some dry needling done to the leg I'm not allowed to run for a couple of days he says if I get an itch to run maybe hold off until through, uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday Friday is not a run day for me, so the earliest I will run will be on Saturday. Uh, so I think I might be doing some more strength-based exercises, all upper body, maybe some core, nothing with the legs. I don't want to risk aggravating it. So I might do that after work tomorrow. Um, yeah, but yeah, I just wanted to share that update. Gone way too crazy <laughs> in one session or two sessions. And that's what's caused it. It's just, I'm probably lucky that I stopped when I did and didn't cause myself any drastic injuries. But yes, get on top of it, get it sorted, get back to training. Maybe next week. Still do stuff this week, but nothing fast. Um, I'm standing here because I really like this sign. I got it from an op shop for like two bucks and that's why I'm standing here I'm trying to show it off a little bit yeah there's something wrong with my GoPro on the screen here I need to replace this GoPro it's getting damaged <laughs> so yeah life isn't all about waiting for the storm to pass it's about learning to dance in the rain if I oh, you could uh, put that to any scenario I could put it to this I need to dance in the rain it's good fun anyway I'm not gonna keep this video going for too long uh, thank you guy for your help. I appreciate it. It's good to see you checking out the YouTube channel now um, Yeah Above all have a great one guys stay strong. You've got this Bye